channel, Sila Partra Ivan Vasilchuk. Today we'll talk about standing position. So Jenny and I, we spoke about standing. So often when you show kids, you can see from a side. But when you do by yourself, you cannot see yourself. So that's why, guys, I'm telling you, 21st century, everybody has a phone. Put a phone and record your training, how you wrestle, how you drill. Go home and watch it again. Oh, see, my leg will, did not go where it's supposed to go. So it's hard to be abstract and think abstractly, like go from your body and wash from the side. It's, you gotta be like a medium, right? Or take some drugs. So, videotape yourselves and watch and analyze. Today we talk about stand-up, basic things, but some people don't know it still. Watch. You gotta wrestle in one stance, I'm tired of saying that. But some people still say left or right, switch, and we'll throw him this way. Before you get to this level, y you lose a lot, so learn how to wrestle from one stance. You don't write with the left hand, right? Because you have no time. So if you're at lecture, you write with your favorite hand. Same thing with wrestling. There's no time for that. What's the principle of wrestling? We have right leg forward, right arm forward. Big, do not be standing stand like this. Because I'm unbalanced here and I'll fall. And you cannot do like this with your legs together. I will not react to his actions. And third, when we cross over, another mistake. When you cross, your feet. So always stand with your right stance. Look at my shoulder. We have a cross. Cross. Here's legs and shoulders perpendicular. And do not rotate your far shoulder so it's not cross anymore. If you switch your shoulders, you're losing balance. So our balance is when feet and shoulders are perpendicular. And you are on your rear leg. Rear leg. If he grabs me, I can hop out. But if my weight is forward on the forward leg, if he knee taps me, I'll fall. So your goal is to make your opponent make mistakes. So we figured that's how we walk <coughs> if i walk forward i start with the front leg back back leg to the right start with my right leg i don't cross so with the far leg if i go to the right it's like this left like this back like this <coughs> and it's important to keep him parallel to keep your partner parallel you see how we shift our chests are parallel one more thing circular effect when he shifts here i shift it on the rear leg you see or you can do it like this you can move your back leg too i don't recommend though use your rear leg more as he shifts we use our back leg and we trail if he goes before parallel he can do a lot of throws. If he goes to this side, same thing. He rotated and he's in attacking position. So also there's distance. Tight, middle and far distance. When you're tight, when you're like this, you, you can throw or fly. We're talking about middle distance right now. So stance. I have an online course about stance. Check it out. Buy it. A lot of lessons that will teach you how to move, how to break grips, how to set up somebody to be thrown. So always parallel to your opponent. If he runs, you rotate and maintain status quo. I don't cross my feet. I don't look at him like this. I'm already at a disadvantaged position. So guy rotates and you just look at him. And look, I, I lost the position. So I always move. Always in motion. Feel that the grip is not yours. Break it and continue wrestling. A lot of nuances here. It's hard to do it in one video clip. So sometimes you watch a blogger 
and they show you like little tricks and then you watch another film and in this feed you are not in a studying mood so to speak but if you get a course you submerge and you study the course and then you repeat it during practice and then it will be effective so if this is enough that's good just remember one thing don't stretch don't stand together like this with your feet together don't cross over and keep your weight on your rear leg so you can work with your front leg if you're on the front leg your weight on the front it's hard to sweep with the far leg so guys get my online course it's in the description stance is very important for any grappling style uh, unless it's sambo partner because we're already on the ground so everything starts from movement up and it's important how to set somebody up it's very important to wrestle correctly standing because if you get thrown you lose your mood to wrestle on so stance is important subscribe to my channel see you soon Ноги борются, он начинает забегать, а он его глазами сопровождает и все, и проиграл.